What's good, YouTube? We are back with another video. I am Jay. And I am B. And, and it's Jay and B TV. TV. It's been a minute. How do yeah. you feel, Vitala? Um, been on this channel. I feel like. Sh <laughs> yes, me too. Um, I feel because like we have not. We been. have been neglecting the channel. Very neglecting the channel. Um, it feels good to be back. I guess like every time we do a video like this, we always come back for like two seconds and then leave again. <laughs> But it ain't gonna be like that this time. <laughs> we always say that. Yeah. So it's basically actions now, but yeah, yeah I, I feel appreciate. weird because last time yeah. we said the same thing. We're back, we're back. And then come back. No. But this is gonna be different Very because different. we have no choice but to be back on here. Really. We do have a choice, but No, we don't have a choice. You know we don't have a choice. I mean No, we don't. Okay. <laughs> we don't I have mean... a choice. So um I posted it on our channel, I mean I posted on our Instagram stuff a couple days ago saying that we were going to actually drop this video uh, a few days ago, but <laughs> like I said, we were stuck in those ways of yeah. saying one thing and, and not doing it, but today we have to do it because of the big announcements, uh, one of the big announcements was that we quit our jobs yeah. we are homeless <laughs> look at that no. we don't have jobs no more so how do you feel about about that i feel fine i'm happy <laughs> because i already done with the shit anyway yeah. <laughs> like bro yeah no we, like oh, i don't care like, we don't have jobs no more we don't have jobs it feels so free and happy for me free and happy um we in a different type of you know what i mean a different type of situation. life situation lifestyle so any other people, if they quit their job, they'll be kind of fucked up. Yeah. We're fine. Um, <laughs> this is just another, you know, uh, uh, what, what's, the, what's the word for it? Um, stepping stone yeah, or whatever. Yeah, stepping stone. Because we've been doing YouTube for how long now? If you want to just get um, into eating or you want to... I don't know. I'm over here chilling, trying to talk. Right. Um, yeah, we can get into eating, but right. we've been doing YouTube since, well, it's when we first started. Right. It was like, what, 2000 and... 16? 16 was it with us? Yeah, the yeah. couples thing. But us, the couples, when we started the couples channel, it was 2016. Jamal was like 2013 or something like that. I started YouTube <laughs> 2013, just bullshit. Yeah. On the phone. I never I logged. I had those videos. Yeah. I really wish. I never logged into YouTube on a, on a, like a desktop or anything like that. Mm -hmm. It was always. On just a phone, I had a little iPhone. I don't even know what it was, like an iPhone three. An Android or something? No, I, oh, no it was iPhone. always iPhone, but it was just like the was it iPhone four, four or something like yeah, that. I think yeah, it was four because of the three. I don't Woo, know. Culver's Burgers. Yeah. Bang 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 bang. Let me let me write. Did you put anything on here? I put mayo and ketchup. Well, there's no mayo and ketchup on here. It is on the bottom. Oh, on the bottom. Yeah. Okay. I got the order right now, but YouTube. Woo. Um, all right, this is dark pan. So we didn't really get serious until 2016. That's when, you know, I had one video. I did, <clears throat> I did this reaction video. He did this reaction video of Kanye West, uh, the Fade. Yeah, that Fade video I when it first came out. Fade. <laughs> and I took the video, the actual video, off because y'all know it, it premiered on uh, some MTV yeah, or something, something like that. that. So I took the regular video off Twitter because you know everything gets on Twitter. Mm -hmm. So I did a so reaction video. Of it, then he yeah. re re reacted to it like. I did a reaction video to it and I posted it on Instagram. I mean on, on YouTube. On YouTube. That was like one of my first like reaction videos. My, my first His reaction. first video. Like it was exactly. like the first video on the channel. And on the channel. It got like five. It was almost a million. It was almost a million views. It was almost so a million. Fast, yeah. They snatched it down and gave me a copyright. And wow. y'all know that shit takes forever to get off the channel. And I think that's one of the reasons why our channel went downhill from the get-go. Like, we yeah. wasn't getting no promotion, no nothing from our we channel, just, from YouTube. The, when we first started Jam B, we was doing videos off the strength of anything. We, had, right. we wasn't making no money. We was just doing the videos just to do them. And we used to do, like, literally almost seven videos a day. A day, reactions, all that stuff. This was just, this, and this was the same time when everybody was getting, getting big. This was around the time where... Where Bianca from DNB Nation and this mm -hmm. is around the time where uh, she started the channel with Damien. Yep. Damien we used to do YouTube by himself. Yep. He used to try to do YouTube by himself, mm -hmm. and I remember all that. Then I remember when they started, I remember they was like come up with us, then they mm -hmm. just shot up. They shot like up. one of the YouTubers that just shot up around so the time. Growing, exactly, around the time that we were trying to get big as well like the only people that was big at the time that people was like really looking at was blasphemous 
um, Dara Ken, like it was like normal, normal motherfuckers that already had a million. That everybody else was kind of like trying to get behind them. You know what I mean? It wasn't saturated. It wasn't saturated yet, mm -hmm. but. <clears throat> Like I said, to say that, to say that, like we 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 used to give it our all, but we never really gave us our all. Like yeah. gave it our all. Like, so many people quit their jobs to do YouTube, and you know, cause that's what they really Stuff want to do. Stuff always flourishes for them. And people was always flourishing out there. For us, it was just like we gonna do it, but we not gonna give our, you know, cause we're not gonna give up our nine to five. Exactly. Like, like, we gotta pay bills. We gotta mm -hmm. do all kinds of shit. But yeah, um, now this time I feel like, you know. Patala ASMR channel flourishing heavily. Um, I got my ASMR channel. Um, it just feel like. It's been here. Mm -hmm. It just feel like it's, it's, it's time to actually execute. Execute, cause like we can go really, we can go back to them jobs if we yeah. ever want to. Like if life ever fuck fuck us up, we can always go back to them jobs. Recognize five. Live the same lifestyle that we always live, mm -hmm. but it's just like now it's time to try to do something bigger and something better and sort of like you know how, how you feel about it. But yeah, the story, better. the story about it. I can tell you a little story time about how it happened. Um, oh, pickles! Oh, I told them no pickles. I said only thing I want on there is mayo and ketchup for all the sandwiches. Like I even got the pickles on my sandwich, but um. The story to how it went, it was just like, it was just one night where we were just sitting there and oh, I was yeah. like, bro, I'm like, I gotta go to sleep. He was like, you wanna play the game? I'm like, oh, no, I gotta go to sleep to get ready to get up and go to go for work. I mean, go to work. We both did. I go and to we, both had to, we both had to go to bed, but he more of a, he could say like at 10 or 11. I'd be like, I'm going to bed at 9, I need to go to sleep. So, you know, I just go lay down, you know, I'm in the bed, I'm just chilling. He out there, he out here in, his, in the living room and stuff like, and he just come in like, you know what? Oh we God. already was talking about. It. Yeah, we was talking about. We was considering it like like quitting our jobs and stuff like that, but it wasn't like. We always talk about. Off the humbug, how we did it this way. Like he was just like, you know what? We're done. I'm just like, wait, what? Like we was talking about it, going back and forth. Like it was just like weird because it was like when Jamal get feelings about stuff, I always follow because it's like he's kind of like a, a, a like a, you know how people be have like the prophecies and stuff like that, but not like he's not a person like okay this is gonna happen tomorrow. Like it's like he had these little gut feelings, and I always follow him. And every th every time he have a gut feeling, it's like correct. It's weird. It's okay, every time we have weird. always get them, and I'll be like, bro, I wish I was one of them people that get that stuff. But like he every he time I have this weird feeling about like certain shit, like good shit in our life happening, like like yeah, good shit. Yeah, every single like, time, and I'd be like, wow, like it's amazing how it works. So that was a little story time, but I feel excited about it. I'm really excited to just like be free of a nine to five. All I have to focus on is school. I'm graduating this May. All I have is one semester left and then the rest of it is just like fully focused on YouTube and you know, growing as a couple, growing as a, a business and just getting everything together. Like I'm very excited. Like I'm happy because I'm like, bro, I never quit my job. I, I always, it was always like, you know, something bad will happen or I'll go to another job or something like that. But you know, so I this is our first time willingly like, since we've been kids where it's just like, you know, like not working, just like seeing each other 24 mm seven, -hmm. like seeing each other. It haven't been like this since we was like kids, like summer from high school no. before, mm -hmm. before, before nine to five was even available. Before you, before 16, before you can't get a nine to five. You know what I mean? Like, and we just I like, think it was like 2013. My, I don't well, even know. Cause you got, you got the job at Papa John's. My first job was at Papa John's. Mm -hmm. I remember just being at your crib when mm -hmm. I first got my. Oh, his first day and everything. I'm like, oh my god, it, I watched him leave. Exactly, exactly. Mm -hmm. so I remember my like, first ever start, like work a legitimate job. Like we would work like little shit, like Cap Hope, and, mm -hmm. you know, stuff like that. But I was saying before my brother and then walked up in here. Uh, yeah, like we always had like nine to five and stuff like that, like Cap Hope and all that extra shit. Mm -hmm. But yeah, this was like. It's funny where you can remember when you first started a job until you like, like we're not we're not older so we can't really say it's retired because yeah. life you never know what life yeah, brings back so good. you might go back to work so I'm not gonna say like we retired but it's just like we just you know left gracefully for our jobs you know we still left where you know we could go back mm -hmm. so we ain't just did like oh, no humble oh, no, like, like fuck oh, y'all I'm out of here because <laughs> like, at the end of the day like you know. I'm always big on like financially straight and stuff like that. So we're we're fine when it comes to shit like that. But it was just like this, it's just like being able to like do everything that you want to do. And once 
you're done doing that and let's say you in your 30s or something like that you really have nothing to even complain about mm -hmm. like i think a lot of people our age should do something like this where it's just like but we in a we in a lifestyle where it's just like you know you gotta work to mm -hmm. to, to, to survive but yeah. if you have any means about any you know I feel like you should do something like this where it's just like you should just leave everything behind. Take that leap of faith. And take the leap of faith because at the end of the day, once you get old, you're really going to be like, man, I, I should have uh, And I know so many people who work nine to fives for years and something happened, then a job just let them go. Mm -hmm. And like, bro, you killed your, you, you killed your everything. You know what I mean? Like, when you're all into this, sacrificing so much you, for that job, bro. And so it was. And they'll let you go, bro. Yeah. Like, and sometimes you be sitting there thinking like about jobs. Like, these jobs don't give a fuck about you sometimes. Like, you uh -huh. really think about like, like, if somebody passed away or something with your daughter or they 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 come first. They don't care about your well being and stuff like that. So I'm like, why well, put my energy into these jobs, bro? Like, right. yeah, they pay my bills, I, I stuff like that. But like, really, I don't put. That's why my. For what? For what? Like for them not to give a fuck about you? Like right. we we are learning our lesson about stuff like that. Like well, definitely. for real. So and that's why I always tell people that if you're gonna do five hours, eight hours, ten hours a day at your job, make sure you do at least more, at least one hour more. And at your hobby, you know what I yeah, mean? Yeah, something like, that you're interested in. If right? you do eight hours at work, make sure you come in at home and do nine hours on something that you really want to do. Mm -hmm. If you and you gotta work 24 seven and you like doing pain, you like doing videos. Mm -hmm. You need to be, you, you like doing music. You need to be putting in as much time into your craft that, that you're putting into your, to, you know what I mean? To, to to this job because most of these jobs don't give a fuck, bro. Like, no. you spending all your time there and not really on your craft. So this was just like the stepping stone. And don't get us wrong, like we just not, no flu gaze you ass niggas. A lot of this shit came from hard work. Like, you know what I mean? Like, a lot of sacrifice, a lot of hard work. You can't just wake up one day and just say, oh, I'm done. Like, bro, you got, you got bills, you got this, you know what I mean? So, yes, you have to work hard to get to a place where it's just like, when you do quit, you ain't gotta worry about bills, you ain't gotta worry about food, you ain't gotta worry about clothes, you ain't gotta worry about still living your life. Yeah. Like, if, if you want to sacrifice like that and you want to quit, uh, you go take down life. That's not me. I, I could, I still want to be able to do shit that I want to still do without a job. Yeah. You know what I mean? And that's how you're supposed to work. So when you do get out of a job, you still can. You ain't got a budget. You know what I mean? Motherfucking lose their job, but like, no, I don't do that. You know, just get to a place where you want to be and you feel like you got enough money monthly that you can spend. You be like, hey, I'm quitting my job, and that's how we got. Yep. And we was already talking about quitting them, yeah. but not this soon. Not this soon at all, no. It was gonna be a while from now. Um, it wasn't like a humbug thing, how we just jumped to it. Like, it was random, he was just like, you know what, we just, it just happened, and it was like really just kind of- But Tyler scary. was about to quit in like two more quit. weeks. Yeah, I was gonna quit in like two more weeks, so that was already set in stone for me. Yeah. My, my work schedule and my school schedule conflicted, so it was kind of like, right. okay, I'm just gonna be done with it. I'm not gonna yeah. worry about no work. When I could just like focus on my, I'm about to Go graduate ahead, this May, you know, finish and, it off and then and be done. And be like, done with the shit. Mm -hmm. So she was already about to quit. Me, I wasn't about to quit. Like mm -hmm. I was just gonna continue. But as we kept talking about it, we we kept going. It was one of those things where it's just like, you know what? We might as well. Yeah. We might as well. Like all these channels, we show up and down. The only channel that's consistent is Batalas. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And if we got other channels that's monetized that we don't. Take advantage of it. Like, we, we don't, don't post on this channel right here. You know, we don't like, we don't have no fire intros. We don't like, everybody on YouTube and upgraded. We just kind of still like, still here, like, still the same. So it's just like, you know what? <laughs> let's do this. Let's give this our all mm -hmm. and see where it's gonna get us. And if it don't get us nowhere, all we can say is like, we, we tried. tried. You know what I mean? We tried. And you know, you, you won't regret it. Cause it's just like, bro, I did this, this, I did that, I went here, I went there, and it didn't work. But if it do work, then you know what I mean. Like, but I don't like things like that. I, I'm, I'm always that type of person where it's just like, it's gonna work. Like, yeah, if I want don't something, put that in the air, you yeah. the negative energy. I'm that type of person. Like, once if I want something, I'm gonna get it. Like, yeah. I want to do something, I'm gonna do it. So I'm not the type of person that just be like, oh, if it don't, if it don't. But you got. When we talking to people like y'all, we don't want to seem too cocky or seem like, you know what I mean? So you got to have the benefit of the doubt, but I'm not that type of person. Like, 
What? And now we have more news. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we just went off on a tangent on that one, but. Cool, we had a lesson on the other one. Oh yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure. Now everything on here, so no support. <laughs> Watch our videos, see them. <laughs> We're on that! We're not on that support. We might be our last meal for this month. He just Help said, us. This must be our last meal for this month, because y'all probably wouldn't understand nothing you just said. This is going to be our last meal for the month. So, watch our videos, share them, like, subscribe. We need y'all help. We ain't got no job. <laughs> <laughs> we need help. Who's there? But go ahead, what's your brother there? Um, the next set of news is, um, I don't know how to tell y'all this, but, um, <clears throat> um, no, I'm just kidding. People are like, is it a baby? Like, uh, nah, bro, we ain't damn. playing. I don't know where that's gonna come. I don't know either. A lot of y'all want us to have kids, bro. I don't know, bro. I don't know when that's gonna come. That's gonna come when it comes, I guess. Right like there. I don't think it's gonna be a planning thing, though. Yeah, I think it's gonna not. happen randomly. I don't think, cause I feel like planning. I don't know. It's irritating, like. Just planning the baby. Yeah, like we about, like, we about, about, we about to start. Then it's like when it don't happen, it's like then you get more stressed. Like damn, I can't. Yeah. Can I have kids? You know, so stuff like that. But yeah, I think um, it might just happen randomly. It might just happen randomly, and then we'll let y'all know for sure. Cause I'm <laughs> great. I'd be like, yeah, y'all, I'm pregnant. But, but yeah, um, the other side of the news is we not. It's not no kid. Sorry yeah. for people that. And it's also not a ring on his finger. So mm -hmm. everybody thought marriage. No, not yet. People be like, we young as hell, damn, let oh, us be. Like, that let us get to the life. <laughs> bro, I don't understand. People just be acting like, bro, we are not that type of couple, bro. Mm -mm. We understand life, we understand everything, bro. Like, y'all just be trying to. Marriage, kids, house, gated And family. they don't even get, and then sometimes y'all don't even care about what y'all spouse feel. Y'all be like, I hope it's this. Yeah, right, because if it was me, it'd be this. No spouse would probably be like, right? Like, if I was together with my couple, my um boyfriend for ten years or whatever, I would have been married. Like, right? Okay, I want to. But the thing is, way, that people feel like though, like people need to know that we started young. Yeah, we started. I young. can see we started at, like twenty five, like we was twenty five years old, and then we've been together for like ten years. That's right. different. But when you started, when I was. I was 14. We you know? started when we were fucking kids, bro. Mm, like, now we're in our teens. I mean, now we're in our 20s. It's kind of like, bro, let niggas live, bro. Yeah. Like, let niggas live. Let niggas enjoy life and all this other shit. Like, like you don't want to. And that's why the, uh, you know, the, the rate of divorce so high. Mm. Because people at a young age, 18, 19, thinking like they got they got their shit together and they didn't get married they wanted to get in their 20s and they really start experience life they like oh shit you know what i mean mm -hmm. and both of them might agree it might not even be no conflict of interest like you know what i mean both of them might agree and be like bro we did this shit too young you know what i mean yeah. like she yeah. might start feeling somebody else he might start feeling somebody they might get to each other like bro this ain't what it is you yeah. know what i mean i don't really love you like that no more like yeah. And that's how it is, but not saying that's what we is. It's just like it's like y'all gotta allow people to be live sure their life. Be sure to to know. Like, yeah. hey, I actually want to marry. This I'd rather be with somebody motherfucker that that knows they want me rather than doing something quick and being like you know fight urges on some Tyler Perry movies mm -hmm. or some shit <laughs> like fight urges or hide some shit or living a double life because they don't know how to tell me or some shit. Yeah. They just they just a different person like I don't grew up. I grew up Jamal. I wanted to, like, you know what I mean? Like yeah. I'm just thinking like my this is different. Exactly. Yeah. Like I'd rather for us to live our life and, and you know go at it how we want to go at it. But in the next news is the second news is. <laughs> We're actually moving. Yeah. Right and right. we're was actually we're we was gonna actually do this uh supposedly been March, March first, so yeah. you know January's almost over. Yeah. It's February about to be here. February. February here. February's gonna be a moving month, but you know, we we, we decided just to push push our lease here back a few months. Yeah. Not that we're gonna use all a few months to stay here. Not like we're gonna. We actually push it back into like what June. Yeah. And ain't like it's not gonna be like oh we're gonna move in June. Yeah. We might move a lot we earlier, might move but I just earlier. needed to push it to have more time. So the 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 cities were. Um, it was Houston. I mean yeah. Dallas, Houston, whichever one. Oh, yeah. There, uh, Texas. Um, what was it? Arizona. Arizona. Yep. Yeah. And Los Angeles, California. Yeah, Los Angeles, LA. Um, it 
it was a lot of conflicting stuff because like we wanted to mainly move to LA most right. definitely right. but bro the cost of living is just like crazy Trust me, I didn't want to spend no four to five thousand dollars a month monthly now yeah monthly on a two bedroom bro it's not it's like we don't, the thing about LA is the problem like the space for us because exactly. like we, we we move for the space so like if we get like we get bigger every time we move we get bigger and bigger and bigger so it's right. like we want space so why move to LA and get like a 900 square foot two bedroom well, like, apartment with all this stuff that but we like, like five to four thousand dollars bro like oh mm, hell, hell no nah. Like hell no, I don't care how much money I got. I'm not about to that's, that's yeah. a trick. Mm -mm. You trick it off. So out of all that, we decided to go to basically Houston. We are going to Houston and we're actually gonna be out there uh February or is it we're gonna do it the end of February. End yeah, of February. February. We're actually gonna be in LA at the end, end of February. End February yeah. So we gotta figure out how we're gonna squeeze that in there. So yeah. it'd probably be the first week of March we go to Houston. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, first, yeah. probably yeah. like that first week. We're probably gonna go to Houston, set up a, a, a few houses to look at. Look at it. Cause that's what we've been doing right now. Yeah. We've been looking at Shashi Batala. Uh, yeah. Dealing with a few uh, realtors. Realtors, yeah. And they've been sending her a lot of houses, houses and, and stuff. stuff like that. But now we want to get like, the feel of it. We want to actually see them in person. Because sometimes, yeah. like, when you see pictures, you're like, oh, that's nice. Like, and you might get in, like, oh, I don't know, like, the vibe. Or, exactly. You got to just feel everything out. So we're just going to get ready to do that. Uh, exactly. Yeah. I'm just trying to see what's time oh. It's probably like 30 minutes, bro. 20 some minutes. Yeah. Oh, shit. It stops at 28, so. 24. Yeah, we can wrap it up, though. We can talk for a minute. Oh. Yeah, but it stopped at twenty. It stopped at twenty nine. Once again, okay. but yeah, like I, like I was saying, we we are we're gonna do that. We're just gonna go ahead and just you know figure take out the house. Take y'all on a journey with us too. Oh bro. yeah, take it, bro. Man. We're finally, like I said, we're finally done. Yeah, we did all that. Uh, we got burgers and we didn't even eat, but we talked a lot. Yeah. But yeah, we just had to get out of here because we didn't, you know, explain a lot. So I didn't want to. You know, just be eating, and you know, it's been a, a long time since we've been on the channel. So yeah. I just wanted to catch up on y'all. Like we, it's gonna be a lot of vlogs. It's gonna be a lot of like, bro, we have, we have nothing else to do. Yeah, at this point, like, all we can we do gotta, is yeah. film. I can just worry about school. Yeah. And then film at the end of the day, it's just filming, yeah. and you know, that's it. So everything is gonna be entertainment based on this channel. Please don't be all y'all chats. There's a lot of funny things that we want to do on this channel. As far as like just everything, everything. Don't, even, don't even put a, a cap on this channel. And it's just gonna be entertainment based. So I hope that you get a laugh out. I hope that you get a kick out of all the things that we plan on do on the channel. Um, the serious notes that we're gonna be doing on the channel, as far as like the blogs and all the stuff like that. Yeah. You know, taking y'all, you know, to LA. We're gonna be in LA. Um, from the 24th to the 27th or something like that. Yeah, yeah to the 24th to the 27th, and we're gonna be. Oh yeah, and then we got another trip for spring break. We got a lot of trips that, that we're gonna be going on. Like then we're uh, gonna be Houston first week of March. Yep. Then spring break a little later. We're gonna be in Miami, so there's gonna be a lot of shit that we're gonna be bringing y'all to, and we just hope that y'all, uh, you know. Follow us, like us, subscribe. This is JMB, and this is <laughs> the farthest we about to push JMB that we ever yeah, did. Yeah. And just not even inside the house. It's just gonna be everywhere. Everywhere. And just hope that y'all fuck with us. And other than that, I wish you got you got something else to say. Oh no, I'm just happy to be on. Like I'm just I'm just excited about everything in the future. Like it's like a, a weight lift off my shoulders. Like bro, ugh, like I'm just free. Like I can just do whatever I want right. to do. Like now I'm about to graduate. I'm so happy about that. Like I just. <laughs> 2020, 2020 vision. Yeah, 2020, so, we're just like yeah, move just up. Happy. Or you move down. It's all up to you. Yeah, you know what it's mean? all, it's up, all to up to us, you. Yeah. But anyway, I am Jay. And I am B. And it's Jay and B TV. Hope y'all enjoyed this small mukbang, whatever we want to call it. We didn't really eat like we supposed to. No. But this is just a lot of announcements to let y'all know. And y'all comment below. Tell us how y'all feel about all this. And uh, y'all got some ideas from the channel, whatever the case may be, put it down below. And other than that, let's just have a conversation and the conversation. We out. Peace. Peace.